God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son. God is our Father. He placed us here on earth as a part of his plan. He wants us to return and live with him again. He knew that we would be subject to sin and death. So he provided a way for us to overcome these obstacles. Jesus Christ opens the way for us to return to our Father. Son, be of good cheer. Thy sins be forgiven thee. This man speaks blasphemies. <laughs> Who can forgive sin but God alone? Wherefore think ye evil in your hearts? For whether is easier to say, Thy sins be forgiven thee, or to say, Arise and walk? But that ye may know that the Son of Man hath power on earth to forgive sins, Arise, take up thy bed, and go unto thine house. Jesus paid the penalty for our sins. I'll be willing. We can find forgiveness as we show our faith in him, repent, and follow his commandments. Through his grace, we can be cleansed of all our sins. Lord, if thou hadst been here, my brother had not died. Yet I know, even now, that whatsoever thou shalt ask of God, God will give it thee. Lazarus, come forth. Loose him and let him go. I am the resurrection and the life. He that believeth in me, though he were dead, yet shall he live. Jesus died on the cross. On the third day, his spirit was reunited with his glorious, immortal body. Touch me not, for I am not yet ascended to my Father. Because he overcame physical death, all of us, will be resurrected as well. Resurrection is a gift from Jesus Christ. God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. By overcoming death and sin, Jesus offers us salvation, which is the greatest gift of all.